Okay, so a couple of months ago, I decided to up my fashion game and I thought I'd try the biggest fast fashion brand on the market, Fashion Nova. I needed some sexy outfits for my arsenal. Oh my gosh. And also some for IG pics. <clears throat> Go follow my <clears throat> IG. So I'm trying these out and letting you know the dirty deets on how they fit on a size seven. That's me. I'm gonna let you know what works. 10 out of 10 would highly recommend. What doesn't. At first I was like, ooh, and now I'm just kind of like, ah, damn, yeah. I wasted my money so you don't have to. So without further ado, let's go. Let's try it. <laughs> I'm strong, she said, hello. <laughs> I'm wearing my faja in case you're wondering, and uh, this, oh my gosh, this hugs so nicely. If it looks a little weird here, I have the faja a little too low, so I'm gonna lift it up on my next one, but oh my gosh, this looks so freaking cute. It has ruching, it is beautiful. It also has um, some spaghetti straps, and you can either wear it with or without. I'm pretty sure, no, because on the website, it has the straps, but um, I know there are some dresses that are meant to like not wear the straps. These are literally just hanging garments, but I love how dainty that is. Looks so cute. And the back, in case you're wondering, she's a peachy. This looks cute. I really like this. This is really cute. Thoughts on this one? I definitely think this is a 10 out of 10. I would definitely wear it out. It doesn't feel too short, because you can definitely pull this down more. And, oh my god, this pattern, so freaking adorable. Girl, the ruching, everything, super cute. The cleavage, I love it, I love it. This is so cute, Woo! She said orange creamsicle realness. It's a little see-through, you can definitely see the underwear going on underneath, so you definitely have to wear some sort of tight, something to cover it up, because if you do not want people seeing anything, you definitely are gonna have to wear something underneath. And also, you can see my faja, so this is definitely not good to wear if you're wearing a faja or anything like that. I really, really, really love the color. I feel like it looks really good on my skin tone, so if you're like on the tanner side, I feel like this is gonna look really, really nice on you. I give this a seven out of 10, only because again, it's see-through. But she's still really cute. This is something really nice to throw on to go to TJ Maxx. Just like a little shopping moment with some slides and some sunglasses. You get a little purse. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. I got this for like a little bit of a Kim K moment. The lining on the inside definitely feels hot. <laughs> Girl. All right. Um, I do have to say though, it is sticking to my legs right here, so if I like do any sort of weird movements like this, the dress kind of comes down a little bit with it. Girl, I just, I got this for a little Kim K moment. When I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, Kim Kardashian, yes, bitch, all right, we're gonna, ooh, okay. It makes a weird noise, so this is definitely gonna get an 8 out of 10, because I love the way it looks on me. But there's just a little bits of like where it's sticking to my legs. It's super hot. So this is definitely not something you would want to wear like maybe out. Ooh, I don't know. Maybe this would be like more for Instagram if you want to get some cool IG pics. Okay, so it also has this crisscross detailing on the front, which honestly I thought was going to be a lot more difficult to put on. But it was literally just like throw it on and you're good to go. So it is super easy to figure this out. But it was a little hard to get this up my butt. <laughs> like I was struggling to get it through my thighs because like, I mean, it's bigger than the rest of my my leg. I'm twirling in this dress. I actually really love it, but I can't give it a nine because of the sound and also the fact that it's sticking to my thighs and it's a little hot, but aside from that, ooh, this is so cute. I wasn't expecting this one. Okay. When I initially, <laughs> I feel like the Grinch. <laughs> oh no. Wait, this feels like, uh, this feels like pajamas. At first I was like, ooh, and now I'm just kind of like, ah, damn, yeah. I don't know about this one. I feel like this one for me is more for pictures. I feel like the top looks, I love this racer back thing here that's going on. The zipper you can adjust, nope. Nope, that looks weird. There we go. It has to be a certain, it has to be a certain mm, three quarters of an inch down, but then we have this back. Sorry, the bra. You need to wear like pasties with this. Uh, the you know what the back is actually super cute, but it, because I have this issue of butt hanging out, we have this weird spacing thing. So um, it's this is. Yeah. 
Initially when I put this on, the way that like the pants go up my legs felt weird. <laughs> okay. But only because I'm already sweating and it just does, it feels really weird when you're already sweating. But um, aside from this, I look like a blob of um, <clears throat> dairy. <clears throat> I don't like this one. This is probably gonna get a four out of 10 because ooh, we, ah, ah, it's, ugh, what is this doing for me? This is doing nothing. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. I love that I'm wearing underwear and you can't even tell that I'm, see this detailing? You get a little bit of skin showing here. You can't even tell I'm wearing underwear. Yes, beach! Yeah! I am extremely, extremely excited about this dress. This looks so cute. Look at the detailing. I love the gold chains here. We're just gonna get like, we have gold chain detailing right here in the middle. Then we have it on the sides as well. It comes up like this. It's very sexy too. So it shows a little bit of skin. I would definitely say wear a thong that you can kind of pull up high. I like that right here. It's not, is it on both sides? It's it's closer together right here on both sides. So if you are wearing underwear, you can't really tell. Definitely wear a thong with this one though. But look at the color. I've been, I love pink. Pink is my favorite color. I don't know why I don't have anything pink, but uh, this is, this is it. We are going to Vegas in February. So this is gonna be a dress that I'm gonna be packing with me to Vegas. Super excited. It's gonna be my brother's 21st birthday. So we're gonna party. Woo! The zipper on, oh, I forgot to show you guys. The zipper on the back. The zipper goes all the way down. There's two zippers. It goes all the way down. This one's so good. 10 out of 10. Would highly recommend. Worth your money. Yes. Not, I don't know why I got a medium. I thought it was going to be bigger, but medium is normally what I wear that fits right. I should have gotten a large. Honestly, I should do an extra large. I wanted these to be like baggy. Look at this. They're, they're joggers. I wanted these to be baggy warm-ups that would just look really cute. I can pull out the pockets to make my butt look a little bit bigger. This is weird. Why do they go straight down like this? This is super weird. Anyway, yeah, they're not bad. I just, I messed up. I totally got the wrong size. So these feel, and they feel really warm already too, but I love the color. I really want to exchange them for a bigger size because I cannot see myself wearing, uh, if I wear warm-ups, I like them baggy. I cannot do them super tight so this is a mess up on my part but aside from that the fabric is really nice the drawstrings okay i don't i don't know how i feel about the drawstring but i'm sure you can do something like really cute with it i'm not that creative back here oh that's nice because you can put your phone i really like that okay if i had gotten these in the proper size large or extra large then i would definitely i don't know if i should do a large because it's pretty tight here on my legs um, I am tall, I'm 5'7", so I have to just mention that. So, these aren't bad though. Honestly, these look kind of cute. So, if I had gotten the right size, I would say that this would be definitely like a 9 out of 10. Because they're gonna keep me warm, they look super cute, cute color. I might just exchange these, I'm not sure. Okay, these are like my favorite, my new favorite bell-bottom pants. I used to be obsessed with bell-bottom pants, and people would make fun of me all the time, and now they're in, and I'm like, Whatever, anyway. Cute is this? Oh my gosh. I love these. They're butterfly print. I also got this in a dress. That's how obsessed I am with this print. And they are bell bottoms. Can you see that? So these are very stretchy material as well, so I really do appreciate that. I just like, I like these kinds of pants where they're stretchy. It's literally just effortless to throw on. You can just head out the door, go get your nails done, whatever you want, but I like these, these are cute. These are really cute. I didn't want to put it on right away because it is hot in this room, but this is a little cardigan that I got from, um, for, for, oh my gosh. This is a cardigan that I got from Fashion Nova and it is super cute. I've worn it like once or twice, but it is kind of hot. Yellow, it's adorable. You can literally wear this as is or just wear it. Oh my God, I'm trying to, because it doesn't go with this shirt at all. But um, I'm trying to put it on properly, but it doesn't go with the shirt at all. But this is something you can literally just wear, no undershirt, uh, I would say just a bra, and put it on, like button it up, and it's literally a cardigan, but a shirt at the same time. Honestly, Slayer. Okay, so just imagine I wasn't wearing the tank top, and I was just wearing, you know, just a bra under or whatever, button like this. Honestly, 
honestly, this would be really cute. Or like this with some high waisted shorts, but I'm not about that life. That isn't that isn't my kind of life, but super cute. I love it. This is definitely a nine out of ten. Pants are a ten out of ten. Now for the butterfly dress. Okay, so this is literally the same material, same print in a dress form. Absolutely love it. I want to say they had a top, but I was like, I don't feel the top. I don't want to do a matchy matchy pants and top kind of thing. Uh, but I really love the dress. I was like, I have to get the dress. I have to get the pants. Then I can match the pants to something else. This is so cute. Absolutely love this. This is a 10 out of 10. I just It just hugs me perfectly. It feels really nice, comfortable. Super, super nice for this heat, this Texas heat. Oh my God. <laughs> this is one of my favorite outfits. I've worn this a couple times already, but this is something you definitely have to go braless for, wear some pasties because um, it won't cover up your bra at all unless you wanna wear a nude one. This honestly will make your butt look good too. But uh, I do have to say the front part, this ruching part, so weird. But aside from that, I really, really love this outfit. I love the way it feels. It's like a really nice like spandex. Is this spandex? Or I don't even know how to, I don't even know what kind of material this is. Oh, it's also bell bottom. Oh my God, this outfit is so gorgeous. This is gorgeous. This is literally a 10 out of 10. This, holy cow is gorgeous. You got two slide slits here, so like, bam, bam. Oh my gosh, this is this is gorgeous. I saw this on the website and I was like, I have to get this. Honestly, I got this for my birthday, didn't wear it, we didn't go out because I had to work on my birthday, but um, ooh, 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 ooh. This is so cute. It does have a little bit of a shoulder pad moment, which I think I tore the left one. Honestly, I feel like the shoulder pads add to the dress because if it didn't have like a shoulder pad moment, I feel like it would just be kind of like bleh, you know? But you could definitely throw something here. I kind of wish it had like a little bit of like a, a tie thing here or like this weird like, do you know what I'm saying? Not weird, but like this little like bunched up thing right here. But this is so gorgeous. You could definitely put a belt on it, but I'm not that kind of gal. I just, I don't throw belts on, I don't, that's weird. That reminds me of like the early 2000s and I'm not here for it. Not about it. This is definitely something that I would wear to like dinner, but like a sexy like Valentine's Day dinner. This one's a 10 out of 10. I love this one. I cannot wait to wear this one out to dinner. Like with wine, strawberries. I just got all like super sexy dresses. <laughs> Another out to dinner dress. I love it. The ruching's amazing. It does have this nude uh, slip that goes underneath, so it's not see-through. It literally looks like it's see-through, but it's not. It hugs super nicely. I really, really, really like this one, and I like that it's an off-the-shoulder type dress. It's super nice. I just think the only thing is like the ruching adds a little bit to the panza, but aside from, honestly, aside from that, you wear a faja. It's not even there, babe. It's not even there, just. So this is definitely an eight out of 10. I feel like this is gorgeous. I do feel like it's one of like, like a basics dress. Does that make sense? Like it's super nice, super sexy, but it's not like a, oh my God, this is my favorite piece in my closet, but it's, it's nice. It's something I would put on for dinner. So just putting that out there in the, universe honestly out of everything my favorite outfit is the pink bodycon dress with the chains if you're debating on anything i would definitely say get that one that one's a really great birthday dress vegas dress going out dress i just it's gorgeous um least favorite what's the least favorite the diarrhea dress <laughs> the grinch dress the no 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 the pajama dress it's not even a dress it's a jumpsuit it's not even a dress oh my gosh that one was just like a no no babe no just Hard pass, like don't even, just when you see it on the website, just like, just knock it out there, okay? Just get off my screen, okay? Just get off, all right? Okay, let me know which one's your favorite. Out of everything that I ordered, which one is your favorite? Leave it in the comments down below, and also hit that subscribe button to join the KB family, and I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye, guys. Okay.